Top 10 Things to Do in Bariloque, Argentina. Located on the shores of Lago Nahuawapi, Bariloque's beautiful setting amongst the foothills of the Andes in northern Patagonia needs to be seen to be believed, such is the natural beauty on show, and consequently, it is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Argentina. Known for the wonderful skiing, trekking, and rock climbing that it has to offer, San Carlos de Bariloque is a great place from which to explore the surrounding mountains, lakes, glaciers, and forest-coated countryside. 10. Route of the Seven Lakes The landscapes on show in Patagonia are breathtakingly beautiful and this wonderful route takes visitors past some of the most stunning parts on offer, with the seven different lakes being just a few of the highlights on show. Both the Lanin and Nahuel Huapi National Parks are on the Ruta de los Siete Lagos and the drive takes around a day or more to complete, although the scenery is so wonderful to behold that visitors will find themselves stopping time and time again to take in all of the amazing sights. 9. Isla Victoria. Located within Nahuel Huapi National Park, Isla Victoria is a scenic island to visit that is full of wonderful flora, fauna, and picturesque forests. Wandering along the forest-lined paths is a delightful way to spend an afternoon and the island was once inhabited by indigenous people who left behind cave paintings. With loads of lovely scenery on show, Isla Victoria is a beautiful place to visit and lies on Lago Nahuel Huapi. 8. Cirquito Chico. Starting out on the outskirts of the city, the 65-kilometer-long Cirquito Chico is a great way to see loads of Bariloque's beautiful scenery in one go, and the ride will certainly be up there with the best that you have ever done. Taking you past such splendid sights as Lago Nahuel Huapi, around the wonderful landscapes of the Yao Yao Peninsula and numerous other mountains and lakes, this drive will certainly live long in the memory and there are loads of lovely stop-off points and photo opportunities along the way. 7. Cerro Auto. Located within Nahuel Huapi National Park, Cerro Auto reaches a height of 1,405 meters and the panoramas on offer from its summit are divine as Lago Nahuel Huapi lies below it and the Andes can be seen off in the distance. Bariloque itself actually lies on the mountain's lower slopes and visitors can reach the summit by car, on foot, or by cable car. While there are some lovely mountain biking and hiking trails on offer, as well as skiing and other outdoor activities during wintertime, the main reason people visit Cerro Auto is for the incredible views of the surrounding mountains, lakes, and forests. 6. Refugio Frey Hike. One of the most popular trails in Bariloque, the Refugio Frey hike is perfect for nature lovers and outdoor adventurers as you pass such stupendous scenery and at the end there is a delightful little lodge where you can take a breather or stay for the night. To reach the beginning of the trail, hikers either take a chairlift up the side of Cerro Catedral or wander along a beautiful forest path before traveling past such incredible sights as the Rucaco Valley and the spectacular Cerro Tronador, which you can see looming off in the distance. 5. Cerro Campanario. With arguably one of the best views in the world available from its summit, Cerro Campanario is a must-see when in Bariloque and visitors will be astounded at the stunning panorama that greets their eyes. Accessible by either foot or car, visitors can also opt to take the scenic chairlift which lifts them up the mountainside and Cerro Campanario towers 1,050 meters above sea level. The views from the top are simply divine, as perfect blue lakes are dotted amongst forest-clad hills and snow-capped mountains. 4. Park Municipal Yao Yao. Lying around an hour outside of town, the Park Municipal Yao Yao is full of wonderful trails and paths that wind their way through forests, meander along lakeshores, and snake their way up mountainsides. The landscapes are remarkable for the pristine and untouched feel about them and there are seven fantastic viewpoints scattered about the park for guests to find. Wandering along the well-signed posted paths is a relaxing way to spend the day and visitors are sure to head home tired but happy with all of the amazing sights they've seen and there are loads of great photos to be had here. 3. Cerro Tronador. The highest mountain in the region, Cerro Tronador towers to a height of 3,470 meters and is home to eight glaciers which are captivating to explore. Located in Nahuel Huapi National Park, the extinct stratovolcano lies on the border of Argentina and Chile and is a popular tourist destination as it is not too far from Bariloque. The scenery on show is marvelous as fjords, lakes, and sweeping valleys punctuate its slopes and the areas around it. With three distinct peaks and numerous lakes and river dotting the area, Cerro Tronador is definitely worth a visit for the wonderful nature on offer. 2. Cerro Catedral. Located inside of Nahuel Huapi National Park, the towering Cerro Catedral is home to Bariloque and South America's most popular and largest ski resort. 
One of the main draws to the area is the fantastic skiing that can be had, and from the center of Bariloque it takes no time at all to take to the slopes. Covering a huge area, the ski resort has loads of pistes and runs dotted about the scenic mountainside and the views of the surrounding area are simply riveting for their beauty. With snow blanketing the mountains and trees, the bright blue lakes stand out all the more delightfully against the winter world around them. 1. Nahuel Wapi National Park. Breathtakingly beautiful, Nahuel Wapi National Park is simply a must-see when in Bariloque and it is one of the main attractions that the city has to offer. The scenery on show is stunning to behold as snow-capped mountains lie next to perfect blue lakes and their forest-coated shores. With loads of outdoor activities on offer, visitors can hike along the paths that weave their way through the forests, go kayaking on Lago Nahuel Wapi, rock climbing on the mountainside, or simply relax and take in the unbelievable views from atop of the mountains that dot the area. The landscapes are simply divine and the rivers, waterfalls, and glaciers that clad the slopes of the Andes only make it all the more beautiful to gaze upon.